I'm Annie. I'm a junior at Duchenne. And this is my poem. It doesn't have a name. Stay close to people who feel like sunlight. But I'm the moon. I reflect your energy like a distorted mirror. Your warmth is morphed into an image of my own, and I make you believe that I am something that will allow you to grow. Until you shine the wrong side of me, then I wane and disappear, and you'll wonder where I went. Slowly, I will back away, leaving only the ghost of the crescent I once was. The people call this the new moon, but this cycle is anything but new, as I have been hurting people since my birth, for 4.63 billion years, I have deceived Earth to make me the sun of the night. But I don't initiate photosynthesis. The flowers don't bend towards my light. All I influence are waves crashing and crashing, breaking rocks into thousands of pieces, disrupting the silence of the beaches. Well, maybe I'm the man on the moon. Let me cast my fishing line, and maybe I'll catch a fish who's naive enough to think my light is the sun's. But I'm 93 million miles from the sun. Still, fireflies try to communicate, asking me, why am I like this? Why do I fake the light? Why can I not create my own luminescence like they do? They blink Morse code to me, trying, trying, trying to know me but I cannot blink back. The stars surround me, they mock my inability, and even though they appear to be so much smaller than I, they are able to do what I never can. And I watch as they create their own light, own warmth, but I stay cold and dark and dull. And the humans who live 238,855 miles away like to romanticize my presence. They innocently think I whisper them goodnight with forehead kisses through the blinds and swim in the waves I create. The poets say they are inspired by my craters, but they forget how I deceive them. Maybe they are not even aware. <laughs>